Hi, this is James Wan. It's James the Wine Guy here to talk about Old World and New World Alianico. Now, it's a uh, the mothership is definitely Italy. When you think about it, it is coming from Campania and Basilicata, and uh, very famous through history. So, two millennia worth of lots of packed history on this particular varietal. And um, then you think about New World. Uh, California has Alianico as well as Australia. Outside that, you don't really find it. To the best of my knowledge, I can't find it in other uh, uh, producing nation states, wine producing states. And um, for me, it's a great homage. And when you, I don't want to put this versus this versus out because these are different uh, climates, different uh, landscapes altogether, different soils, and it's just fun to compare these together and um, side by side. Um, they do come from the same grape, but it's like comparing uh, Cabernet from uh, Australia to um, a Chilean to a U.S. or a Napa Cabernet Sauvignon. While the uh, centrals are there and that familiarity is there, they are different wines. And uh, one, in my opinion, you can't really say one is superior to another. I think it's all about the winemaking style. It depends on what the, you know, the weather did that year, that vintage. And in this uh, particular one, we have a multi-vintage, which I think you're going to see many more multi-vintage wines in the future. And um, I think that that's a pretty cool characteristic. And it's one where I kept looking at this bottle and thought, I, I don't see a, a vintage. So I looked online and found it's between two different years. So if you get a chance, compare and contrast. And uh, don't compete when it comes to tasting wines of the same varietal from wine-producing regions even uh, near to each other. For more wine reviews, please go to jamesawineguy.com. Please subscribe to my videos on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Vimeo, Google Plus, Pinterest. Salud. And salute.